Welcome! In this video, we are going to look at using the Equid e-commerce platform along with Headless WordPress on your site at Stratic. Now, if you've not heard of it before, Equid is a great headless e-commerce platform that lets you not only sell on your website, but across a range of other platforms as well. Plus, they offer a WordPress plugin that integrates their entire dashboard into the WordPress admin area. This brings along with it a range of custom Equid blocks and widgets that you could use throughout your site. We could set up Equid on Stratic in five simple steps. First, we're going to install the Equid WordPress plugin. From that plugin, we could sign up for a free account or log into an existing one. Then we want to explore the full range of settings that we have in the WordPress admin to control our Equid store. From there, we could add our products to different parts of the site using the built-in blocks and widgets that come along with the plugin. And finally, once we have everything set up, we will publish to our static site to test everything out. Now, let's take a look at what this involves. We're gonna start in our WordPress dashboard on Stratic and search for and install the Equid plugin. Once you activate the plugin, You'll be taken to the dashboard where you can connect your existing store or create a new one. Equid has both free and paid accounts, so you'll want to explore which options are best for you, but I'm going to connect this to the free account that I already have set up. First, I'll be asked to log into my Equid dashboard, and then I will be asked to authorize the connection between my Equid account and my WordPress site. Go ahead and click Accept. And now we'll see that our online store is ready to go and we have a couple of other steps that we could complete as well. Now, what I wanna point out are a few things in the settings, including the sales section where you will see your orders come in, your catalog where you could access all of your products. For this, we're just using the example products that come when you first set up an account. You have categories, gift cards, marketing tool integrations, reports on your e-commerce, including things like being able to connect your Google Analytics account. And then we'll see options for selling across other channels besides your website. Then we can come down under configurations into the storefront where we can make customizations to some of the design aspects to our site, look at payment integrations, shipping and pickup options, as well as the general settings for the store itself. After you take some time to familiarize yourself with all of the Equid settings, come down into Pages and you'll notice that it has created for you a store page. And onto the store page, it has added the Equid store homepage block. You could see that there are many settings that you could go through to control how everything looks. And if we view the page, we could see that it's a great looking layout and we could click in to view individual products, add them to our cart, and do the entire checkout process. Now you could also see that it comes with a sign-in link where people can put in their email and get an automatic sign-in link. They do not have username and passwords for their account, but they do have this sign-in option where they can manage their accounts. And if we come back in to edit the page, we could see that there are actually a number of different Equid blocks that we could use throughout our site. Adding a simple product, adding a buy now button, all sorts of different things that you could use. And in fact, if we come back to our site and look at our homepage, we could see a few examples of these blocks in action. We've got an individual product here, as well as a list of products from a certain category. And if that is not enough, there are also widgets that you could add throughout your site. So if I come into my widgets and go to add a new widget, if I search for Equid, you'll find a number of different widgets that you could add anywhere that you have widget areas. So a lot of customization options offered here. I wanna show you one more setting in the customizer that's very important, which is the shopping cart widget. This is this little thing right down here. So normally this will only appear on the store pages. However, usually it's a good idea to have that showing on all pages. So I want you to see where that setting is and see that you could actually customize how it looks and where it appears. So a lot of different customization options that we have for Equid and WordPress. Now, once we have everything set up how we want, it's time to test on static. And that's where we come into Stratic Publish. You can publish live directly. I like to recommend doing the preview publish first. 
And once that is ready, we'll come over to our static site and we can see everything loading as we would expect there. So make sure to test the entire process. But there we have it. We are fully integrated with Equid and a WordPress site. Again, that was five simple steps. We installed the plugin, we signed up for a free account, we explored all the settings, looked at some of the blocks and widgets, and then we published to our static site. And there we have it. We are fully integrated with Equid and a WordPress site. And now you have an e-commerce site that is built on WordPress and runs perfectly on Stratic as a static site.